Eternals. 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 Have arrived. Vintage film stock hoodie right here. <laughs> What's going on, guys? I'm Chris. Welcome back to another video. Joined by my lovely friend Cam. How you doing, Cam? Good. That was not English, was it? Not really. Joined by my lovely lady friend Cam. We're here at Best Buy because it's not just any Blues Day Tuesday, as the kids call it. It's the day after Valentine's Day, but we're here because there's a certain steel book that come out. You can tell from the title of the video. I'm gonna go try and pick that up. Hopefully, they still have it. Best Buy opened like 10 minutes ago, so hopefully, they still have some in stock. Yeah. If I see any other goodies on sale, I'll probably pick them up. But without further ado. See so you guys inside. Make sure to hit the like button. Comment your pickups down below. Are you going to get this steelbook? What edition of Eternals are you going to buy? See you guys inside. My girl was snubbed of an Oscar nom. No respect. <laughs> no respect. Honestly, I'm not crazy about the slipcover. Like, I just don't like the design. That's cool. I wish they had put this on a slipcover like that with a black background. The steelbook just takes the dub for me, for sure. And I still need to get the last duel, maybe. Maybe. Still have to watch this movie. If someone wants to become a phase three level patron, I'll watch it and review it. And King Richard, one of my favorite movies last year. I might have to pick this up, actually. Something regarding Cobra Kai might be coming to the channel soon, so stay tuned for that. And I still don't own Dune, no desire to. I'm very excited for this version to come out with Timothy Chalamet. Oh yeah, the only Star Wars movie I don't own, I used to have the original Blu-ray slipcover, but I actually sold it. I own Shang-Chi, of course I own that, even though it's a bad cover. Solo, I own this exact 4K without that artwork. I need to get the slip cover, so if someone has the original Solo slip cover, feel free to send it my way. We have the PO box. Also, this movie is wildly underrated. I went back and rewatched it. Top seven to six stars movie, ton of fun. Kim. Yeah. Have you seen Free Guy? No. Do you want to see Free Guy? No. <laughs> okay, I've never seen this movie before. However, off topic of the movie, apparently, Hopper's cabin is an escape room in Atlanta, which I think we should do. This is the dream camera. Boom, there's a quick little snip of what I got. Two things, I'll have an unboxing in a second. Two seconds later. All right, so I'm back now. I got my two Blu-rays right here. I'm gonna do a little unboxing of these. Uh, they're both 2021 releases, that's all I'm gonna say, but I'll show you what I got right now and then I'll, uh, I'll do the unboxing after. But first up, I have King Richard, uh, the Oscar-nominated film for Best Picture, Will Smith's nominated for Best Actor. I'd love to see him win. I would love to see Andrew Garfield win as well. Like, either way, I'm not gonna be upset because they're both long overdue for Oscars. But this movie's awesome. I really like the slipcover, very simple. It's a Warner Brothers movie. I'll unbox that in a second. Might even have a digital code giveaway. And of course, I had to get what I came here for. Eternals on Steelbook, the Best Buy exclusive. This is the best way to go when it comes to the packaging for this movie. Just look at that. All the Eternals in their glory with those beams behind them. The back's pretty cool, I'm pretty sure, once you open it up. And the interior artwork is Erisham the Celestial, so it's really cool. Big fan of the Steelbook, and I'm gonna give you guys an unboxing. Time to unbox the Eternal Steelbook. Does anyone else, when they're opening a Steelbook, are looking around, like, try not to dent anything? Because I'm paranoid about, like, buying a damaged Steelbook or, you know, getting one with dents or accidentally damaging it in the process of opening it. I'm a big freak about steelbooks, but they're fun to buy and they're addicting. So you got this right here is the front, the J card, and there's the back of it. Boom, they take it off. There's the front, Eternals. There's the back, love it. And there is the side right there, Eternals. Open it up, we've got the digital code right here, which I'll do a giveaway for at the end. You've got the discs and then Arishem in the middle. I'll take this out so you guys can see. There's the inside artwork in all of its glory. Sorry for the reflection, but that's the Eternal Steelbook right there. Honestly, a thing of beauty. One of my new favorite steelbooks that I own. And here I've got King Richard, which again, there's the Blu-ray. I won't really unbox this because it's a standard Blu-ray, but it will have a giveaway in a second. So those are my pickups for the day right here. Quick little Steelbook and new release from last year. Do you guys go out and pick up Eternals? I know it's on Disney Plus, but the Steelbook was calling to me. I had to go out and get it. I'll be definitely doing a No Way Home Blu-ray home when that comes out. I already pre-ordered the Steelbook. There's a little spoiler for what's to come. To enter the digital code giveaway for either Eternals or King Richard, all you have to do is make sure to hit that like button. Make sure you are subscribed and comment down below your favorite movie from 2021 since these are both 2021 releases. And also leave a place I can contact you so that I can actually give you the code if you do win. I can message you. But that's going to do it for this little Blu-ray hunt. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. I'm very close to 6k subscribers as of posting this video. It would mean the world if we could hit that very soon. I have a merch store. It's got the vintage film stock merch on it, so feel free to check that out. But thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time, I'll see you guys later. <laughs>